Hello children. Hello sir. This is class 3 subject my living world and chapter number 1 my body. Okay, shall we start with the question and answers? Yes. Yes, something to know. See I've given all the answers for you. You also read it and write it in your book, okay? Okay. Okay. So first one fill in the blanks. Our dash is sensitive to different tastes tongue yes you are right tongue is sensitive to different tastes right next one loud sounds are unpleasant and harmful for ears yes so how you will hear you will hear to your ears so loud sounds are very unpleasant and harmful okay this see all these answers are from the books if you read your lesson two three times you if you will know answer for all these questions okay right third one dash help us to feel smooth and rough surfaces skin correct so we see the boys they uh, know they blindfolded and touched all the thing and they understood which one is smooth which one is rough so your skin help us to feel smooth and rough surfaces now the fourth question we should avoid reading in dash light we should avoid reading in dim. dim light okay when the light is low you should avoid reading in the dim light okay the next fifth one we have five sense organs we have how five. many sense organs five sense organs we have five sense, sense organs. organs okay the next one write true or false for the following statements our body has many parts Blue. Correct. Our body has many Blue. parts. Second, sense organs help us to sense various things around us. True. Blue. Sense organs help us to sense various things around us. True. We can find out whether the tea is hot or cold just by smelling it. False. <laughs> so, can you smell hot or cold? No, you can smell that. No uh, flavor. but if it is hot or cold you should either touch it you can only feel it feel by if it is hot or cold but when you take take your no nose near the or no a tea no when the when it is hot no you will get a hot smoke that steam will come okay which will touch your skin there you can find it is hot or cold but not by smelling so it is false okay we get the feeling of pain when we are injured True. So when we are injured or any any insect bite us, we get pain through the feeling. That is correct. We can find out the color of a leaf by just touching it. Okay, you close your eyes. Can you touch something and tell the color? No, false. No, false. So you can see the color, but you cannot feel or touch the ear the colors. Okay, right. Next, we'll go to the C. Pick the correct option. We feel through our how do you feel the pain or no anything rough or smooth surface you feel it through your skin you feel it through your skin skin we should take bath when you should take bath daily <laughs> you all taking bath daily so you should take bath daily, daily. correct it is a it is not a sense organ okay there are four things given here which is not a sense organ is is correct nose ears skin are all sense organs stomach is not a sense organ you are right okay next is d answer the following questions in brief see i have given you the answers here you can also note down name all the sense organs eyes ears nose tongue skin correct there are five sense organs and these are all the sense organs the second question what does our nose help us to do nose Smell. help us to smell so you should complete the sentence you should not give one word answer you should say nose help us to smell like that you should say okay what type of sounds are differentiated by our ears see you should read the lesson loud and gentle sounds are differentiated by our ears loud sound and gentle sound and we can also differentiate from where the sound is coming like you know humans humans means we are all humans what where who makes the sound humans animals vehicles and where the sound which direction the sound is coming this also we can differentiate 
okay do you do mimicry do you know what is mean by mimicry uh you 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 could have seen in the um, uh, no in tv some uh, some people know they will do mimicry they will make different sounds they will make sounds like a train see you can also make sound like if if someone makes sound you will you will think that the train is coming but actually it is a human who is making a sound okay so mimicry artist you go and ask your father and mother what is mean by mimicry what is mean by mimicry okay right the next one why should we meditate and exercise regularly so the answer is we should make we should meditate and exercise regularly to take care of our sense organs to take care of our sense organs sense organs okay right so let's go to the next one right there are five questions here okay so i have given answers for this question so let's go one after another name the different types of tastes draw a diagram of a tongue showing all its taste that is question number 1 how are eyes useful to us question number 2 list some pleasant and unpleasant sounds around us question number 3 fourth question is write the role of skin on our body okay and question number 5 is write any two activities where we use more than one sense organ okay now i will take you to the answers okay right see here are the answers for this question okay the first question is name the different types of taste what are the different types of taste sweet sour salty bitter and umami umami means like you know a little what a tomato and all gives that umami smell okay so and draw a diagram of tongue showing all this all its taste see what which where you will feel sweet in the front part you will feel the sweet in the front part you will feel the sweet where you will feel the sour in the side part you will feel the sour where you will feel the salty in the side part again a side and the front part you will feel the salty and bitter in the back side of your tongue bitter in the back side of your tongue and umami in the overall tongue you will feel umami in the overall tongue okay the second question is how are eyes useful to us how are eyes useful to us eyes help us to see various objects around us eyes helps us to see various objects around us okay the third question list some pleasant and unpleasant sounds around us pleasant sounds what are all the pleasant sounds music song children talking these are all pleasant sound unpleasant sound is traffic horn ambulance sound crackers these are all unpleasant sound okay right okay. fourth question write the role of skin in our body skin helps us to know rough and smooth surfaces it help us to know hot and cold temperature and feel pain of injury and skin also protects the parts of body below the skin so this is the answer for the fourth question okay you also read it and write it okay what is the fifth question write any two activities where we use more than one sense organ so what are all the two activities you tell me when you are eating what all you do you will feel you no know, when you when you take food in your hand you will feel whether it is hot or cold that is number 1 number 2 you will smell the food number 3 you will eat and you will also know the taste okay so the next uh, uh, activity is watching tv or movie watching tv or movie so uh, when you are watching the tv all your eyes and ears are all you no know, active okay right okay now i've given answers for all the five questions right you also write this in your book now let's go to the next set of questions right so now we are going to see the value based question now we are going to see the value based question okay rahul a keen observer rahul is a keen observer noticed that over the last few days his grandfather was not very quick in responding 
to his request so his grandfather was not very quick in responding to his request demands or queries he mentioned this to his father so rahul went to his father and told see grandfather is not responding properly no he is not responding quickly so his father immediately decided to get him checked by an ENT specialist who who is the ENT specialist what is the expansion of ENT e means ears n means nose t means throat so ears nose throat okay so ENT specialist the specialist checked the grandfather's ears and provided him with a good hearing aid so he was unable to hear so he gave a, a small instrument called a hearing aid okay hearing aid Rahul's grand Rahul's grandfather felt very happy when he was again able to hear clearly with the help of his hearing aids now let's read the question think of the problem that Rahul's grandfather might have faced due to his not being able to hear clearly so what are all the problems you no know, you will face if you cannot hear properly if you cannot hear properly so if you are at home when you are at home when you are at home no what are all the problems see you cannot watch tv no when someone is calling you no you cannot hear them so these are all the problems you will face at home when you are on the road what will happen if someone is no um, uh, giving you horn some car or bike is coming and if they are horning you cannot hear right so you should see all the sides but you cannot hear so that is very dangerous right so on the road you cannot hear the sounds of you no know, different bus bus sound car sound you know cycle bike sounds you cannot hear okay in the park what will be there in the park the birds will be chirping you no know, people children will be playing so you cannot hear all these sounds when you are in the park when you are in market you no know, you have to buy something like vegetables fruits you no know, they will tell you how much how much the vegetable is if you want to buy 1 kg of apple they will tell you how much is the apple but you cannot hear it so these are all the you no know, uh, problems you no know, uh, one can face like rahul father can face when they have hearing problem okay right now let's go to the next question now the next question rahul and his father displayed some values in the situation discussed above discuss with your classmate about the values shown by them so what are all the values we have seen in this see the first one you no know, rahul when he said something when his grandfather did not you know uh, respond him he understood it immediately okay there is some problem you no know, grandfather is unable to hear me he is not responding to me and what he did he did not ignore it right he did not ignore or no he did not no uh, scold his grandfather what he did he went and told his father yes he went to his father and told him right see grandfather is having some problem so that's the value so he has good respect and love for his grandfather so and he is concerned about his grandfather so he went and told his father that grandfather is not responding properly and what the father did did the father immediately took him to the hospital to the ENT specialist see his father also has love and respect and he loves his his uh, rahul's father loves his father his that is rahul's grandfather so he took him to the hospital and uh, bought a new hearing aid for him right so that is the value so you also need to discuss so what you did in your home if when your grandmother grandfather are there so what is the value you have shown them you should also you can also discuss okay right now the third one if you had a classmate with some hearing problem how will you help him or her so if you have a classmate you no know, in in your class if someone is having a hearing problem you no know, in the class how you will help them you will tell them whatever the teacher says when the teacher is telling something you will also so what you will do when your friend in your class has some hearing problem so you will tell that to your teacher the teacher no uh, your friend no you can tell his name and say he has hearing problem so you should talk loud so or you can also say no uh, um, you uh, you can also tell that to his parents like no see my friend is unable to 
hear what you are telling like that you can help in okay and what you'll do in your in a playground when your friend has hearing problem if someone calls you he cannot hear right if someone calls him he cannot hear so you can stand next to your friend and you can guide him see he is telling this see the ball is coming here no now he is going to he these are all the instructions so you can tell him about the instructions loudly right so these are all the help you can do to your friends okay so you also discuss this and uh, let me know okay right you also put what all the things you want in the comments box right give all your answers you have any extra answers any no new uh, thing you find you put it in the comments box okay right now something to do spend some time with your grandparents and share your daily experiences with them assist them in their routine work okay you all have to do this and you will put it in the comment so what are all the help you did to your grandparents okay right now the second one find out about the sensing capabilities of dogs and hearing capabilities of bats how the dog senses and how the bat hears do they have something special yes see the dog see i have given you answers here okay right read this the dog can sense the smell of any object with the help of an olfactory present above their mouth so there is a gland called olfactory so it can smell anything the dogs can identify the object with the help of the sense history of the associated object of they have already smelled it let's assume no it also has a very good memory so it smell it and it will register it in its memory and after one year if it smells it it can easily identify see when you grow a dog even after no when you when you play with the dog now and after one year if you go no your appearance would have changed but the dog will smell you and identify you okay this is my friend like that the dog will identify you okay so they have that good memory okay what about the bats while in the case of bats their hearing organs are sharp so that they are able to hear even a small sound that occurs around them see b- bats cannot see no their eye vision is very very less so they also fly with the uh, no help of hearing okay so whenever they go near they will hear the sound and they will turn so they have a very sharp hearing organs okay all right i think we have completed this lesson okay okay children we have completed this lesson my body that is the first chapter you all go through the video one more time or two or three times so whatever you have doubts you go through it and you can also give your comments ask your questions in the comment box and i will respond to it okay all the best bye bye